What happens when the world's smartest fighter jet gets an engine upgrade from one of the most respected aerospace companies on Earth? What happens when Sweden's Gripen E, already known for unmatched efficiency, is powered by next-generation Rolls-Royce technology that boosts performance, cuts fuel burn, reduces heat signature, and slashes operating costs? Today, we're breaking down how this single-engine upgrade might have just made the Gripen E the most efficient fighter jet on the planet. From day one, the Gripen E wasn't designed to be the biggest, heaviest, or flashiest jet. It was designed to be the most efficient combat aircraft on the planet. Saab built it around a simple but revolutionary idea. A fighter should deliver maximum capability with minimum cost, manpower, and infrastructure. Every core system reflects this philosophy. The aircraft's modular design allows rapid maintenance by small teams, letting air forces keep jets flying with fewer technicians and lower budgets. Its advanced avionics and sensor fusion are optimized for low power consumption, while providing real-time battlefield awareness equal to far more expensive fighters. Combined with the new Rolls-Royce enhanced engine package, the Gripen E achieves a rare balance, high performance, low operating cost, unmatched uptime, and true independence for the buyer. In a world where most jets demand massive budgets and foreign control, the Gripen E stands out as the fighter that delivers more while demanding less. When Rolls-Royce entered the Gripen E program, they didn't just bring an engine. They brought a global reputation for extreme efficiency, reliability, and engineering discipline. Their upgrade package amplified everything that makes the Gripen E unique. Rolls-Royce optimized airflow, combustion, cooling, and durability to squeeze more power out of less fuel, dramatically cutting operating costs while boosting acceleration and climb performance. The enhanced thermal management system not only improves engine lifespan, but also reduces the jet's infrared signature, a direct survivability upgrade. What makes Rolls-Royce different is their philosophy build engines that run cooler, cleaner, longer, and with fewer maintenance hours. Applied to the Gripen E, that means higher sortie rates, easier field repairs, and unmatched uptime for small air forces that can't afford maintenance-heavy jets like the F-35. <sighs> with Rolls-Royce on board, the Gripen E becomes the world's most efficient, high-performance fighter, a machine engineered to dominate without draining national budgets. Let's break down what Rolls-Royce has changed and why these changes matter. One, better fuel efficiency equals more range plus cheaper missions. The improved core and optimized airflow give smoother combustion, reduced fuel waste, longer flight endurance. This means a Gripen E can fly longer missions for less money than nearly any modern jet in its class. Two, higher thrust equals better performance without more cost. The new improvements allow faster acceleration, stronger climb rate, improved BVR weapon carrying capacity, the brilliance, more power without increasing fuel burn. Three, enhanced cooling equals lower infrared signature. A cooler engine means harder to lock on to stealthier low altitude flight, improved survivability against heat seeking missiles. This isn't stealth coating, this is thermal stealth, one of the hardest things to achieve in fighter design. Four, longer engine life equals reduced maintenance cost. Rolls-Royce used better metallurgy, modular components, upgraded turbine resilience. Most fighters in the world face one brutal reality. They are unbelievably expensive to operate. The F-35 costs over $36,000 per hour. The Eurofighter sits around $20,000 plus. Even the F-16 can reach $10,000 plus with aging fleets. The Gripen E, one of the lowest operating costs of any modern fighter, and now even lower. But it goes deeper. One, fuel burn is the number one cost, and Gripen wins here. The combination of aerodynamic optimization, advanced flight software, and now Rolls-Royce fuel efficiency puts it far ahead of competitors. Two. Maintenance is the number two cost. Gripen wins again. The engine upgrade reduces, 
overhaul cycles, part replacements, wear-related downtime, meaning more flight time, less garage time. Three, training costs are lower because the engine is easier on pilots and crews. Less complexity equals faster certification equals lower annual expenses. Four, logistics footprint is tiny. Grip and E can be serviced on roads, in forest clearing bases, or temporary strips without US-style mega bases. Rolls-Royce improvements amplify this by requiring even fewer specialized tools. Most people think the strongest jet wins wars, but in reality, the most efficient jet wins campaigns. Why? Because air power success requires more missions, more flight hours, more operational availability, more jets ready at any given moment. A fighter jet that costs a fortune to fly becomes a burden. A fighter jet that is efficient becomes a force multiplier. With the Rolls-Royce upgrade, the Gripen E can stay in the air longer, be deployed more often, be maintained more cheaply, be sustained by smaller nations. This turns the Gripen E into a strategic asset for countries that cannot afford F-35 style logistics. Efficiency becomes combat power. The Gripen E's new Rolls-Royce enhanced efficiency doesn't just improve one aircraft, it threatens the entire business model of its competitors. The United States, France, and even emerging players like South Korea rely on fighters that are expensive to buy, expensive to maintain, and locked into long-term support contracts. The Gripen E breaks that cycle. A jet that can operate from road bases, use minimal ground crew, burn less fuel, and deliver near fifth-gen performance is a nightmare for companies selling heavier, maintenance-hungry aircraft. It proves that nations don't need billion-dollar infrastructure or endless logistical chains to field a modern air force. It proves that advanced capability doesn't have to come with political strings. And it proves that high performance can be achieved without high cost. Worse for competitors, the grip and ease efficiency plus its open architecture gives buyers freedom. Freedom from U.S. export controls, freedom from proprietary upgrades, and freedom from overpriced maintenance contracts. That undermines profit margins and long-term influence for every rival in the market. This is why the competition is nervous. The Gripen E isn't just another fighter. It's a disruptive economic model that could reshape the global arms market and expose the inefficiency of legacy jets.